The ashen fields are a region of powdery black hills and blackened grass. Embers seem to blow through the air, though they are only small grains of red quartz swept off the hills. The region is mostly barren, except for a thick tubular root studded with sharp poisonous thorns, known as the ashen root. They grow wild, often in thick patches, and is the only plant life found in the region. Being pricked by an ashen root sends a dose of volatile chemicals into the body that reacts violently with the iron in one's bloodstream, causing burning of the blood vessels. While small doses can create first degree burns on the skin, a large enough dose can cause a person to burst into flames. The ashen root never stops growing, and once it reaches a hundred years of age, it transforms into an ashen treant, twisted by the unnatural energy of the region. Racked with pain, tormented by a twisted world, they wail in agony, their shrieks carrying for miles, and attack anyone they come across, hoping to make them suffer as they do. Druids are forced to hunt down the treants out of mercy, to put their cursed forms at rest, and often burn large fields of age and ash root to prevent any of the plants from transforming into the cursed abominations. They would destroy the entire species, if not for the fact it provides a limited food source for the locals. The root, whilst thorns are deadly, can be eaten, often boiled as a stew and tastes similar to a hot pepper, though the most potent can leave burns on the tongue and lips, though most are reported to be quite tasty. The Ashen Hills is mostly abandoned, a wasteland of ruins with thousands of mining platforms still littering the hills and fields. Once the greatest producers of fire gel in the Federation, one day the realm went black and the fire gel went dry, and few know why. Now the region is home to bandits, nomads, and cults who wander the wastes praying to old gods. They worship the god of ash, the god of consumption, the one whispered in the shadows, Olmeth, his hunger never ending, and is claimed by the cults to have caused the dying of the landscape and not the Federation's exploitation. According to legend, a mysterious group called the Curse Nine summoned a gateway to his vacuum realm, and it was his essence that consumed the natural energy of the region, leaving only dead ash behind, and from its remains, twisted life that grew in the wastes. The few nomad tribes that do roam the wilds build mostly small villages of animal skin huts and survive off scavenging and raiding, fighting off the cults. Known as the Forgotten, they are often outcasts and people who are hiding from their past. While mostly neglected by the Federation, Druids do sometimes provide food and aid if in the area, though even this is rare. For more information on Ulmith, please refer to the religion section of the Exemplia Library.